You see them all over Manhattan, pedicabs ferrying people around the city. But tonight, Seven on Your Side investigates found pedicabs operating with motors, blatantly disregarding a law that bans the motors for safety reasons. Our investigative reporter, Danielle Lee, is here now with more for us. Danielle? Diana, those motors help pedicabs travel artificially fast. They've been blamed for traffic accidents, even fires. But we found pedicab operators in Central Park not even shy about breaking the law. For countless visitors, a pedicab tour is the quintessential way to see Central Park. But Seven on Your Side Investigates found these leg-powered rides through nature aren't entirely what they Just see. Dozens of operators breaking New York City law requiring the bike and buggies be solely propelled by human power, adding motors and pedal assist to help with the load. The operators we found unapologetic. I guess it's, yeah, it's easier. It's easier? Yeah. Did you know that using the motorized pedicabs is against the law? No, no, I did not. You didn't know that? They didn't know, despite needing to complete this city checklist to get licensed specifically stating their pedicabs are not electrically powered or use motor-operated mechanisms. I don't have anything to say. You don't have anything to say? I don't think the, the, this story will benefit us. The city council outlawed motorized pedicabs years ago in response to concerns about traffic accidents. In 2014, the New York Post covered this disaster. Pedicab with a legal motor catches fire. Images of the wreckage, enough for potential passengers to reconsider a tour day New York via cycle. Well, after seeing this picture, no. Be detrimental. Yeah, yeah, that is concerning. Three city departments share responsibility for enforcement. But only the Parks Department could say exactly how many tickets it written specifically for illegal motors this year. On average, three a month. If you ask operators playing by the rules... Citywide enforcement barely making a dent in the problem. The industry has to be cleaned up by DCA or police. Police say the law is difficult to enforce because the motors are often hidden, and so it's not readily apparent that the operators are breaking the law. And since it isn't well enforced, your best bet as a rider is to ask if the pedicab you are about to ride has any form of electric assistance.